Assalamu alaikum, welcome back to Ramzan Biology. Today our topic is about the structure of bacteriophage virus. This is the second lecture of microbiology. In the previous lecture, we talked about the structure of a typical virus. Now we are going to talk about the structure of bacteriophage virus. This is a type of virus which uh, infect on a, which attack on a bacterial cell. So the name suggests bacteria is part of the bacteria in the page eater. So this is a virus which is a bacteria eater. Work is a bacteria eater. Talking about diameter, so a diameter varies about from 24 to 200 nanometer its diameter. Let's talk about its parts in its structure. So a typical bacterial page has two parts, a head and a tail part, and due to that it is also called tetpole virus. And moreover, it is also called a complex virus because it is more complex virus. Okay. Now let's come to our air structure. So head and tail, this part is called the head and this part is called the tail part. So bacterial page virus consists of two parts, the head part, this part, and the tail part, this part. This is called head and tail part, okay. Now this, now the head consists of a core which is a genetic material in a case of the bacterial page virus bacterial page virus always have dna bacterial page virus do not have rna as a core a genetic material and always have dna as a genetic material and this outer is a capsid it surround the core okay and the next this is called the collar the the, main, the function of the collar is to connect the head part with the tail part and the next this part is called the tail part. Now tail part is consist of these sheath. You can see here these sheath. These are called sheath. And these are flexible protective cover having hollow uh, tube. Now these are the sheath and these sheath are flexible. Flexible meaning they help the virus in contracting and relaxation. So this work of the uh, contraction and relaxation is done during the life cycle of the page. We will discuss this in the next lecture. Okay. And then also contain hello tube. Now this is called hello, uh, hello tube. And these are like this structure. Okay. And the, uh, the between part, this is hello tube. Okay. Now this is called tail fiber. These these fiber, these are called tail fiber. What is the function of tail fiber? It helps in attachment with the host cell. When the bacterial page virus attach itself with the host cell, the cell in which it uh, attack, this these tail fiber help in attachment with that virus. And this green part you can see here, this is called base plate. And the base plate uh, contain lysozyme. Lysozyme is a type of enzyme type of enzyme which infect the host cell and this is called tail pins tail pins work as a needle like injection like uh, it work as injection so through these tail pins from the base plate the lysozyme enzyme is injected to the host cell through these tail pins okay now i'll tell you why this lecture first of all uh, the parts so contain two parts uh, uh, head and tail the head contain of capsid and the core part and uh, the core part always contain the dna and this is the collar the collar part uh, connect the head part with the tail part a tail part consists of sheath this sheath which, which is contain of a hollow tube in between and these are flexible uh, meaning uh, help in the contraction and relaxation of the bacterial page virus and these are called tail fiber tail fiber help in the virus in attachment with the host cell and this is called base plate base plate contain an enzyme called lysozyme and these are called tail pins this work is a injector in the bacterial page virus virus inject this lysozyme enzyme with the help of these needle tail pins okay so this was about the bacterial page virus so i hope this will be helpful to you and if you are in doubt or a question in this so you can mention in the comment and don't forget to subscribe and share my lecture for the next upcoming lecture and inshallah next lecture we will talk about the life cycle of this bacterial page virus that how it increases its number so i hope i hope this will be helpful to you see you next time